Honey bees are usually not aggressive and only sting when threatened or provoked. But sometimes it happens. The reaction of a person to a bee sting may vary. It causes only mild symptoms in most people, such as skin redness at biting area, temporary pain, itching, and discomfort on the skin. But rarely, about one case out of 100 can be severe and even life-threatening. Severe symptoms occurs within 30 minutes and including itching and urticaria, faintness and hypotension, breathing difficulty and asthma, nausea, vomiting and diarrhea can all occur. Sometimes it can be life-threatening and ended with death. Severe symptoms occurs due to allergic reaction, which is called anaphylaxis. If severe symptoms develop, Adrenaline injection is recommended as soon as possible to save life. Only female bees can bite. Worker honeybee can sting only once to human. Because its stinger is barbed and it lodges in the victim's skin. It damages bees' abdomen and leading to its death in minutes. So, most bees dies after stink biting to humans. Queen honeybees have smoother stingers with smaller barbs and can sting mammals repeatedly. Male bees can't sting because they have no stinger. The venom of the honeybee contains histamine and enzymes. The three proteins in honeybee venom, which are important allergens, are phospholipase A2, hyaluronidase, and acid phosphatase. The sting's injection of apitoxin into the victim is accompanied by the release of alarm pheromones, especially if the bee is fatally injured. The release of alarm pheromones near a hive may attract other bees to the location, where they will likewise exhibit defensive behaviors until there is no longer a threat. That's why sometimes lots of bees sting together to the same victim. Treatment The first step in treatment is removal of the stinger itself. Because even a delay of a few seconds leads to more venom being injected. Once the stinger is removed, pain and swelling should be reduced with a cold compress. A topical anesthetic containing benzocaine will relieve pain quickly, and menthol is an effective anti-itch treatment. Antihistamines is used for itching. Topical steroids also effective. People known to be highly allergic may carry around epinephrine, adrenaline, in the form of a self-injectable EpiPen. For the treatment of an anaphylactic shock, people who have a severe allergic reaction to a bee sting have a 25% to 65% chance of anaphylaxis the next time they're stung. That's why allergy injections, called immunotherapy, is recommended against future insect stings.